Hello, and thank you for the opportunity to demonstrate the Holland Sling Tag printer. I first would like to discuss uh, when you receive a printer, we uh, include a manual that was specifically written for not only the maintenance, but the way to set up the machine and any type of preventative maintenance that is required to make sure that you're getting the best image possible when you print. Strongly encourage that you uh, read this manual. I next would like to talk a little bit about the setup of the, the unit. Um, and let me first just demonstrate the cords that are involved. If you look at the back of your personal computer or your laptop, we're going to need a serial port. On the back of the printer, you will need a couple things. That's going to be the actual parallel port that's going to communicate with the serial port on your PC, and then you have a power cord of which both are provided with the printer for you to set your machine up properly and to communicate with the software. The next thing is to tell you a little bit more about the printer. The printer itself was originally designed for plastic cards. We are actually changing the way this was originally designed and being able to use a polyvinyl. The polyvinyl, as you'll notice, is, is not as rigid. Therefore, we need to make it rigid in order to feed it into the machine. We take some typical mask and tape. We tape it onto the end of the material that we're going to feed into the machine. A couple different times we tape it around to get, to get it to be as rigid as possible and then it feeds through the machine. Once we've fed it the machine, we have to install the ribbon. The ribbon is a thermal transfer ribbon and it is pretty easy to install. There's a button here that when depressed it releases the printer head which allows you to then pull out the ribbon itself. You'll notice on the ribbon the side that actually goes into the printer is ribbed therefore when we want to put a new one on it would look just like this it would be a little bit larger roll but we just slide it right into the location we push back down the printer head and now we've installed not only the vinyl but we've installed the uh, ribbon itself. When printing, one of the things to note, when you look at one of the tags, we are able to print consecutive serial numbers. That is a very important option uh, with regards to traceability that is required uh, for, for your company to make sure that you're covering all materials and things that are used on a specific nylon sling or round sling. The other point of note is the different sizes. We have a 4, 6, 8, and 12 inch standard setup in the system and those are able to be double stacked if you're making one inch nylons or if you're using two inch. So you almost have eight different variables of setup sizes that you can print. The warranty on the printer itself is one year. We strongly encourage you to keep the box. Uh, if in fact the printer was to break, uh, we have a loaner printer that we can get out to you next day and two, you make sure that you use the same box that it came in to ship it back out to the vendor so that it's not the, the warranty is not voided because it was not shipped properly. The last thing we'd like to discuss is the maintenance of the printer. The maintenance of the printer is very important. There's a couple things that we provide in the cleaning kit, one of which is a moisture cleaning card. It's a head cleaning card that's fed in the machine just like the vinyl, and it keeps your head clean on the printer. It's important to do it once we change the vinyl, so every time we're changing a roll, we're going to do that. The last thing is right here uh, you have this piece, which looks like a glorified lint brush, and that's basically what it is and we replace this just as it is dirty. There's no, there's no rhyme or reason when it should be changed. That fits right in the machine and you change that. A clean one would look something like this and it fits directly into it. When printing, sometimes you might have a need for some variable information